so much to do. Okay. Uh, salve, friend. I'm Galerius. Mind telling me who you are and what you were doing in the Shrine of Proserpina? I'm Alex, and we've had this conversation already. Uh, I don't think so. I've never seen you before in my life. Your name's Galerius, and you're about to take me to see Sentia so he can tell me about the Golden Rule, right? Oh, Bacchus, how much did I drink last night? Uh, sorry to have bothered you. No problem. I gotta go. Oh, and since you seem to be in a hurry, you should try out this device I made. Worked real hard on it. Huh. Just attach the pulley to the rope over the lake and hang on to the handles. If it works, it'll be faster than walking. And if it doesn't work, worst thing that can happen is you'll take a swim in the lake. I haven't quite summoned the courage to test it myself. But don't worry, it's completely safe. Probably. Thanks. I gotta go. I'll see you around. All right. See you around. Huh. Okay, so I just... patch it and... That works surprisingly well. All right. That'll come in handy. Um... I think. Maybe it might still be time to say save Yuvia, right? <sighs> Gotta get that. Gotta get that cure. Let's see. This was the place, right? Hi, Virgil. How much would you want to make me a bow? Come on. It's gotta be something. But why? You know why. But how am I gonna defend myself against someone else with a weapon? There are no other weapons in the city. We all went along with the magistrate's weapons ban, so it wouldn't be an issue. That's why I've gotta get in first before someone else beats me. Focus, focus. It's gotta be around here somewhere. Probably on his chest. Maybe he's got a hidden key. I can just get this potion. Save Yuvia. She might be able to tell me where Scintilla went. This damn thing. Whatever's in that great temple up there on the bluff, I bet it's worth a fortune. Go. Yeah. Right. Think anyone's looking? There goes nothing. Okay. The many what? shall suffer for the Shit. sins of the one. one, one. Fuck. Damn it. Okay. Just get back to the portal, it's okay. Come on, man. <sighs> okay, so I can't steal. That's gonna make this tricky. So what, I just 
find a thousand coins and buy it directly. I don't know if I have time for that. <sighs> Damn it. Damn it. Uh, salve, friend. I'm Galerius. Mind telling me who you are and what you were doing in the Shrine of Proserpina? I'm Alex. We've had this conversation. Uh, I don't think so. I've never seen you before in my life. Galerius, about to take me to see Sentius, Golden Rule. Yeah, we've been here. Oh, Bacchus, how much did I drink last night? Uh, sorry to have bothered you. No problem. I'll see you later. All right. Um... Steal it. Have I been here? I think I have. I'll have to come back here later. Don't you just love springtime? Priestess. What about the priestess? You, Tantalus, cannot catch the drops of water, and the tree you grasp at eludes you. get a thousand coins if I want to save her just how am I going to do that Still have it, shouldn't I? Time, Dacius, not I mean, I didn't drop it on the run. You know why? But how am I going to defend myself against someone else with a weapon? There are no other weapons in the city. I do. I still have it. We all went along okay. Okay. Cool. So it, so it wasn't for nothing. What are you doing in here? Can't you see this woman is dying? She's been poisoned. She needs the resin of a plant called Silphium, but that Kulas Kumbolates Decius won't give it to me. I have some Silphium resin. Here, take some. What? Quick, give it here. Yulia, Yulia, you need to swallow this. Here, let me help you. Hopefully, in a moment, she should be able to breathe normally. That was extraordinary. How did you know she needed this exact thing? And at this exact moment? Are you some kind of oracle? Honestly, you wouldn't believe me if I told you. Ah, uh, look. If you don't want to tell me, I won't look a gift horse in the mouth. But no matter. That was like the gods hearing my prayers and intervening. You just saved a person's life, and you should be proud of yourself. She might even be able to thank you herself in a few moments. And maybe she can tell us who poisoned her, and who she meant when she was muttering about that snake's cruel black eyes. In the meantime, I'm happy to help you with whatever it is you need. Um, no, nothing for now. I think I'm fine. That's a shame. Thanks again for saving Yulia's life. Apollo smiles upon you. Alright, I'll come back later. Good to keep in mind, though. So, anything I take, if I go back through the portal, it'll stay with me. I'd rather not do that again, but if I need to. So 
still locked. Figured. Alright, um... What else? Fresh meat, huh? There's still time. There's still time. I can still save him. <sighs> okay. Um, think, 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 think. You mentioned Centilla. That's my key. Centilla. Worth a shot. Salve, friend. I'm Octavia. Welcome to life under the golden rule. It's a ghastly thing, is it not? How are you faring so far? Actually, I really need to talk to Orpheus. All right, well, it was lovely to meet you. I look forward to getting to know you better over the coming months. And if you ever... I can't believe this is how it ends. Oh, no. No. No, 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 no. Orpheus, what are you doing? Get back from there. If you lose your balance, you'll fall. That's the idea. What? Why? Why would you want that? Why do you think I'm stuck for the rest of my life working for a man who treats me like an animal? I know, I know things are hard for you right now. They're hard for all of us. We're all in this together, Ulpius. Please, please just think this through. If you do this, it could be the sin that seals all of our fates. Is that what you want? I'm sorry, but I just don't care anymore. Please, Ulpius. Help him. If he goes through with it, it could be the end for us all. I don't know what to do. I've never had to deal with this sort of thing. Please, you need to talk to him. Leave it to me. Thank you. And please, choose your words carefully. Look, Olbius. Is this what Centilla would want? You know about that? How is that possible? I mean, I've never mentioned it to anyone. You'd never believe me if I told you. Well, if you say so. You don't understand. I don't want to hurt anyone. I just want it all to be over. Maybe I can help solve your problem. It's too late for that. Yulia and I made a pact. And she's already swallowed Hemlock this morning. If I backed out now, I'd be betraying her. I can't do that. I've already saved Yulia's life. And I'd like to help you too. Oh, really? That changes things a little. But we're still in debt bondage to that monster. Unless you happen to have 2,000 denarii to pay off both of our debts. Look, no, but I could probably raise the money if you just give me some time. No. No. Time's up. I am out. Wherever you are, Centilla, my love. I'm sorry. Oh, Wait! Yes, no! I can't believe he went through with it. I, oh lord. That poor lamb. So what happens now? I'll have to let everyone know what happened. And I guess Maliolus will have to clean up the mess in his villa. It's of his own making, after all. And I'd best pray for poor Ulpius. Damn it! Leap of faith. It's risky, but if I can land in that pond. I can't believe I'm about to do this. Thank you. Thank you. I am delighted and that actually worked. Okay. 
Okay. And now uh, I make this solemn promise. That means Obvious. And now I make this solemn promise to good citizens. Now, under my leadership, you will finally enjoy the freedom you deserve. And uh, if, uh, there's no way his body decomposed that fast. You get out. Or should you walk on eggshells? Fearing simply to live and breathe because the tyrant. I'm being too optimistic. My first act, my first act as magistrate, I hereby, I hereby announce the um, game. Couldn't say it, but. Wait, I, 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 a day of celebration, I announced. I'm not sure there was anything I could have done. A day of celebration marks the end of an era. Maybe if I had the money, but. To his lost love, may God watch over you. Please know that I held on as long as I could, but without you, my life is meaningless. I only hope we meet again. Damn it. Yulia to her captors, Maliolus and Claudia cursed you to the depths. By the time you read this, I'll already be dead. Because death is preferable to another day in dead bondage to you. May vultures peck out your livers and Tartarus for all of eternity. Damn. This Maliolus. Well, I think it's about time I have a chat with him. Did you just leap into my villa from the balcony a hundred feet above? That was either extremely reckless or impressively clever. Well, why have you risked life and limb to see me? Well, let's start with your story. I'm Maliolus. And if it wasn't for this interruption, I'd be practicing my victory speech for the election later today. What'll you do if you win? I'm glad you asked. I'll finally restore freedom to this city, just as I've been promising. These good people have suffered long enough under Sentius's tyranny. And how will you do that? By declaring there's no such thing as the Golden Rule. It's a children's fable exploited by Sentius to frighten us into submission. Wait, don't tell me you've fallen victim to that monstrous lie? Oh, the golden rule is definitely real. Nonsense. There's no way you can prove that. If it was real and you'd seen someone break it, then you'd be dead already. What if I told you I'm reliving the same day over and over again, and the golden rule is broken each time? What? Oh, ho, ho, I see what's happening here. Another poor, vulnerable soul taken in by Sentius's machinations. He won't get away with this much longer. Look, even if I can't prove it, if I'm right, accepting it will avert disaster. If I'm wrong, then accepting it will make the city a better place. Isn't that a good thing? I disagree. I'll be guided by what is best for the city's people, and that means giving them the freedom to do as they wish. I can see nothing I say is going to convince you. True, but that is simply because you are mistaken. Look, do you know a way out of here by chance? I'm afraid not. We're stuck down here together, for better or worse. We're all going to have to make the best of it. All right, I'll be going. I trust you can see yourself out. Through the door this time? There's a key just beside it. Well then. Taking that. Aliolis. It's a dangerous line of thinking.
Olivia. Arve. Excuse me. A new face. Arve, and may Vesta watch over you. I'm Equitia. To what do I owe the pleasure of this visit? I've been asking people about how they wound up here, trying to find a pattern. Interesting. I'm not sure why you're telling me, but you've come to the right person. Did you find a pattern then? What have you noticed? I've noticed a lot of people mentioned an encounter with a stranger on the riverbank. Hmm, yes. I also had such an encounter. What else? That's all I noticed for now. Hmm. There are definitely some common threads there. But I think we'll need at least a few to ensure we're not just seeing coincidences. Keep asking people how they wound up here. I don't want us to rush to any conclusions yet. Livia's fate weighs heavily on my mind, and dictates we should be sure. Yes, you should ask the others first. Alright, I'll do that. See you again soon, I hope. So there was more. It wasn't just the stranger on the riverbank, there was something else. In any case, I should find Livia. Was back here. Uh, excuse me. Just as the ocean accepts the rivers of all the world, so this place accepts all the souls. But it does not notice the crowds that come. You're Livia, right? Can you tell me about the pattern that you saw? You think you wish to know, but you do not. It is better for you if you remain ignorant. Pandora's box must stay closed. I'll say no more. At least tell me what your story is. The bloodless shadows wander without flesh or bone. Some crowd the Forum, some the House of the Ruler of the Depths. Others follow their trades, imitating their previous lives. I'm sorry, I have no idea what that means. They never do. Do you know of a way out of here? There is only a downward path, gloomy with fatal yew trees. It leads through dumb silence to the infernal regions. Do you need help? Help me? You cannot help me. I have seen things. A pattern, a terrible pattern. It is better for you if you remain ignorant. Pandora's box must stay closed. I'll say no more. What do you think about the Golden Rule? The bloodless shadows. This is their punishment. Right. I'll be going now. The newly arrived are ignorant of the road before them. Cerberus lifts his triple head yes, she's not and lets be out help. his threefold braying. Livia, would you stop muttering like Medea over a cauldron? You'll scare away my customers. They follow their trades, imitating their previous later. lives, but they are ignorant. Um, I suppose I could tell Sentius about Aliolas. I really do think if anyone is destined to break the Golden Rule, it's probably him. And that line of thinking is unwillingness to see reason. 
Ave. We're finally alone. I assume you already know who I am. May I know your name? Alex, we've had this conversation. We have? Wait, if I understand correctly, someone is about to break the golden rule, forcing me to create a portal in time to bring you here? I must have entrusted you with figuring out who the culprit is. Only, I assume we failed, and you had to start over. Is that about right? If so, what happened? To be honest, I broke it. You broke it? Why in Pluto's name would you do that? I was trying to save someone's life. Well, it seems you failed. Spectacularly. Look, it's oh. unfortunate. But all that matters now is that you make use of what you've learned and gathered and do better next time. Now, I assume you sought me out again for a reason? <sighs> yeah. Can we talk about who's going to break the golden rule? Of course. What is it? I think I know who it is. Yes? There was an assassin who arrived in the city this morning. What? An assassin? What are you talking about? Apparently, he was sent by Nero to assassinate someone in the city named Quintius. Then what are you doing here, talking to me? Why aren't you out there trying to stop him? You'd best go. Quickly. I don't think I can. You mean to say you've tried every non-lethal measure you can? Uh, maybe not everything, but... Well then, perhaps you'd better keep trying. <sighs> Damn it. Good, thank you. <sighs> I didn't even get the chance to talk about Meliolus. <laughs>